The one beautiful bill is getting uglier and uglier. Trump is all about states' rights unless an industry can buy him off first. And that's exactly what the artificial intelligence and tech lobby has done. They sufficiently donated to his campaign fund and his inauguration fund. So now, guess what's back in the big beautiful bill? States are banned from regulating AI. Trump is all about giving states the opportunity to do what they want when it comes to Roe versus Wade and bodily autonomy. But when it comes to artificial intelligence, he says, no, 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 the federal government has to be the one to regulate this because it's a lot easier to buy off 435 members of Congress than it is to buy off all 50 states' legislatures. But the good news is you have people like me, a software engineer running for Congress, who is willing to regulate the AI industry. My name is Joey Ruzovich. I'm a software engineer, and I actually work for Silicon Valley as a mobile app engineer. I want to do three important things when I get to Congress to regulate big tech and AI specifically. Number one is passing federal legislation to require all data centers to bring their own energy or build their own energy infrastructure when they go to a state or locality so that we are not paying the premium on electricity when they move into town. Number two is to start breaking up these tech monopolies. And number three is to completely ban AI chatbots for kids under 18. There is no reason why somebody under the age of 18 should be talking to a human imitating chatbot. This reduces the amount of human interaction that kids are having. It atrophies their brain. Talk to any teacher. They're telling you that no kid is learning the way that they were learning 10 years ago because everybody is hooked on AI. And now it's come forth that ChatGPT might even be pushing kids towards taking their own lives. This is a five alarm fire. And until the AI companies can provide evidence that they have excellent safety standards for children, this should be banned completely for kids under 18. And it doesn't mean that we have to ban all AI tools. I use a generative coding tool when I do software development. I think it's really useful to be able to type a few lines and have the rest pre-filled for me and I just gloss over it in order to make sure that there are no mistakes. I'm not saying ban all AI tools, but I am saying we should ban human-like chatbots for kids under 18. This is not a radical position. Talk to any parent, talk to any teacher. The damage that this is doing to children right now is catastrophic. We need somebody in office who understands this technology, who can regulate it effectively. My name is Joey Ruzovich. I'm running for Congress in the 6th District of Illinois. I'm a software engineer, and I not only have the desire, but I have the ability to regulate AI. If you'd like to find out more, please go to joey4congress.com.